as some of y'all know, or may not know, kind of the reason they met. It was a warm summer's eve. We found our way going to lunch at Olive Garden. And there, from across the room, there was this blonde man coming forward. I thought a sparkle was in her eye, but it was just him with our food. So, so, after she casually mentioned that she thought he was really cute, I thought it was a good idea to leave her name and phone number. <laughs> As she saw the first one, she ripped it up immediately because she does not like attention upon her. <laughs> so, I had to leave a secret one. Sorry. <laughs> not sorry. You're welcome. You're welcome. Um, and then he, well, Facebook messaged her, and then they went on a date and fell madly in love. And then he was stealing her off to Chicago, and I didn't know what was going to happen. <laughs> I thought she was crazy, but, you know, I got a chance to actually go with them to Ireland, and I just, that was the first time I really got to see them together in a relationship, and I just knew that she had found her Prince Charming and that he was going to take care of her for the rest of her life. And I think back to the first time that you told me about this girl, Jordan, and you were like, dude, red dress, that's all I'm saying. And we were like, okay, man, well, you know, whatever, okay, you know, yeah, I'm sure she's attractive, but we'll wait till we see some photos. And I was like... Are you sure she's not a sister? What is going on? You know, cousin something? No? Okay, whatever. I'll trust you. Woo! It's not Arkansas. Let's say that. Um, but anyways, you know, it really has been over the last, you know, year and a half, two years, getting to know, you know, Jeremy, you even more, like hearing the ways that you've talked about Jordan and hearing the love that you, that you feel towards her. You know, there, I know there was many times I made fun of you for how sappy it was. But it was always apparent how much you really cared for her. And so now, you know, Jordan, we're so excited to welcome you to this family and to say, hey, we got a sister. It's perks that she looks like us already, so it won't be any, you know, it won't, it won't be any confusion. <laughs> when the family photos start showing up and they're like, did you adopt? I mean, what's going on? So with that, congratulations to you two. It really is so apparent how much y'all love each other and how much you care for each other. So welcome to the family, Jordan. token in and pledge of our constant faith and abiding love with this ring I marry you. And I do this in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Jordan, will you now take Jeremy's ring, place it on his left hand. Knuckles. <laughs> He's got chubby knuckles. <laughs> and repeat after me. In token and in pledge. In token and in pledge of our constant faith and abiding love, with this ring I marry you, and I do this in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. I now get the honor to pronounce you as husband and wife in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Let what God has joined together, no man ever separate. Amen. You may kiss the bride.